Hi everyone! So today I am here with another Monday plan with me. This is going to be the week of January the 18th through the 24th and as you can see by my massive pile of like fantastic goodness right here, I am doing a January colored themed spread. So I think all this year I kind of want to at least in every single month incorporate that month's colors into a spread. So I really like January's colors on their own. So I think I'm just going to do a whole spread just dedicated to those colors solely and you kind of know what I mean come like March because I think in March I'm going to use the March colors uh, but I'm going to incorporate like another theme. This is all the stuff that I plan to use with just a few odds and ends thrown in. I have some washi and washi strips from Planner Kate 1 in the January colors as well as I have three of her sidebars. I have the dinner next week and to do. I also have her double dots and her appointment half boxes and then I think I have everything um, from Scribble Prince Co's monthly, at least the January monthly stuff. So I have the, um, what are these called? Mini events, heart checklist, uh, half boxes. These are like the to, to do, to clean, to go type boxes. They also have bill dues, some ombre heart check boxes, some half ombre heart check boxes. I don't think I'll be using those, so I'll save those. Um, the sampler, the icon sheet, the full box sheet, um, the deco sheet. Bottom washi, which I don't know if I'll use yet since I do have some of the bottom washi from Planner Kate. The headers, uh, the regular washi strips, and the little things. So I'm going to incorporate all of this together. So I do think I might pull this washi just so I can use some of it. Um, and I will layer. I don't know if... Because I do want to use the deco boxes. If I use... I think the arrows would be cute. So what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to do the blue on top and then, or maybe I'll do an orange. No, I'll just do the blue and then I'll do the arrows underneath it for my washi. So I'll lay my washi down, my half boxes with the mini glitter page flags, my today headers and my SPC headers for my work schedule and I will be right back. So that's all the basic stuff um, put down. I feel a little like out of the loop today because it's like kind of later. It's already 7 and I don't typically, or I start filming my plan with me's on Sundays at around like 2. So having it already be 7, like this is typically the time I would start editing. I feel very like jumbled. Um, so that is all of like the basic stuff. So I'm going to flip my planner then to Monday through Wednesday and we'll get started going day by day. So as you guys know, if you've been watching my plan with me for a while, my weeks are pretty much the exact uh, same thing. Nothing really ever changes. So first and foremost, I'm going to grab the Planner Kate 1 uh, January Color Double Dots. I think I'm just going to use the um, light orange color to mark Avery's baths. And then I also have two TV shows on that day, so I'm going to go to our little things and just grab two TV icons. 
And then I also have a bill due that day. So I have a bill due, so I'm going to grab this sheet. I don't know what they're called in the shop, but I'm assuming just like to watch or something like that. Uh, but I'm just going to grab one of the bill due stickers. And that's really it. So then I'm going to grab a to-do header. Put that in. An ombre heart checkbox, and I'm just gonna, and then I'm just gonna layer that in. It's a little crooked. And then I'm going to grab a school header. I'm just going to layer the school header a little bit on top of the ombre heart checkbox and then I'm going to grab a full box and put that underneath just like that and from my heart checklist sheet I only need four heart checklists or four hearts on my heart checklist so I have to cut it layer that on top my nose is running really bad. I've been sick the past few days, so I'm sorry if you can hear me sniffling in the background. Um, on Tuesday, it is payday, so I'm going to go back into our um, half boxes, and I'm going to use this verse, instead of using an appointment um, box from Planner Kate. Put this in. And then I'm going to go into our icon sheet. Oh, wait, do we have any sort of? Yeah, we do. From the icon sheet, I'm just going to grab a little money symbol and put that right there. And off of the sampler sheet, I'm just going to grab a teardrop and put that right here. I used to do that all the time. And that's again it for Tuesday. Nothing too crazy going on Tuesday. So I'm going to go into my washi sheet and just place down a piece of washi to fill that space and we can decorate over that later or I could just leave it blank since it is kind of more decorative anyway rather than just the plain washi here and then I'm going to put another to do header and another ombre heart checkbox hopefully this one won't be as crooked and a school header and then I'm going to put another full box there I think I'm going to use this one. There, I'm going to use a teardrop from the sampler sheet as well. Sorry about that. I literally have absolutely no idea where it stopped. My card was full. I'm having like the weirdest planning day ever. Like I said before, um, usually I offload my card, but I just forgot about it because I'm having the weirdest day ever. So I'm going to go ahead and continue then on to Wednesday. These are really light as I can see through here. So I don't know if you guys can read that very well, um, but they are pretty light. I just tried to darken it, but I don't think you can see it even at all. So, so I'm just going to continue then on to Wednesday. Avery needs another bath, so I'm just going to grab another double dot from Planner Kate. Tear that in sideways, apparently. Um, and then I also have a TV show on that day as well. And again, that's it. So I'm also going to put some more washi in. Where did I put my washi sheet? I really need to start like separating these better. So I'll just use this washi here. I need another piece of that. And then I'm going to put a to-do header. And then I'm also going to put another ombre heart checkbox below that. And below that, I'm going to put a school header and a full box, just like that. And then on Wednesday, my heart checklist needs to be its the same color. Let's do a different color. Let's do orange. 
So my heart checklist on Wednesday needs to be four hearts long. It's actually my last week of these particular classes and then I have a week off. I have next week off and then I go back for another 10 weeks. I'm basically 10 weeks on, one week off <laughs> for four years, which is going to suck, but it's okay. So anyway, so I need four hearts and then I don't have any timestamps that match these colors. I'm pretty sure I brought home timestamps for myself, but I don't know where I put them. So um, what I'm going to do, I think, is... I don't know. I have the asterisks on the sampler sheet that I used to use. Um, but I think that's... I mean, I could use an icon. I could use... I could use the time icon, maybe? I think I'll use the time icon since it is a specific time but there doesn't appear to be one I kind of want it to be orange and there isn't one so I'm just gonna use the asterisks I'm just gonna put an a, like a teal type one and then I'll do an orange one below that okay so Monday through Wednesday is done so I'm gonna go ahead and switch over to Thursday through Sunday on Thursday not really much is going on other than the fact that I have three bills that are due um, which is crazy, but it's always been like that. So I'm going to grab my bill due sheet again and just layer three bill dues, um, down there. Okay, so there is all of the bill dues and that's really it again. So what I'm going to do is put my to-do header below that. Since it is kind of cutting into the heart checklist space, I am going to cut my heart checklist just down to four, I think. Yeah, four will probably be good. I'm going to put that right here. I probably could have used the fourth one actually, but that's okay. I'm just going to put a little sliver of washi in there just to fill that space. And then I'm going to put my school header and a full box in there. And then my heart checklist for Thursday, sorry, I'm like all over the place here. My heart checklist for Thursday needs two hearts. No, three, I'm sorry, three. Okay, and then on to Friday. Avery's going to need a bath again, so I'm going to grab another double dot and throw that in. And then I want to put a cl to clean list, so I'm just going to grab, um, oh yeah, I'll just use this color from that sheet. And uh, that's really it again, so I'm going to put a little bit of washi in there. I'm just going to use plain washi. Yeah. No, I'm going to use decorative washi. What am I saying? Okay, and then I'm going to put a to-do header and then an ombre heart checkbox. And a school header and then a full box. Just like that. And then my heart checklist for Friday needs two hearts. And then on to Saturday, first and foremost, I do want to use my weekend banner. Did I not bring any weekend banners? Mm, girl. I don't think I have any weekend banners, actually. 
out of everything, I didn't bring a weekend banner. That's the craziest thing. But I do have multicolor ones somewhere. I just have to find them. Oh, wait, maybe I did. I'm pretty sure these are the weekend banners. <laughs> so anyway, I do have them. I just didn't put them in my stack. Uh, so I'm going to put some washi down underneath that. I think I'm just... Well, I don't know. I think I kind of want to use this washi because I, I kind of want to incorporate that. So I think I'm going to use... Um, the arrows and should I use the plane? But there's no. I'm gonna use the arrows and then the polka dots to bring in some of the orange. Okay, so there is the weekend banner. So then just moving on to. Saturday. Avery does have gymnastics that day, so I'm going to use one of the Planner Kate One appointment half boxes. I think I'm going to use the light blue one. I did order um, someone, I, I'm sorry, I can't remember who commented last um, last week on my last plan with me and found some gymnastic stickers that I really liked from Sweet Bean Plans or Sweet Beans Plans. They're really cute, so I ordered those and those should be here this week, so I will probably use those in next week's plan with me. Uh, but for now, I will just put an icon there and write it in. Nothing crazy though. So let's see if I can find a good icon. So I guess I will just put a heart icon until I get my gymnastics ones in. That works out well then. And then I'm just going to put a to do header. I think I'm going to keep the full heart checklist because as you can see here I had to put a little bit of washi and I think it, it will fit so let's try that and if anything I can always layer so yeah it fits pretty well so then I'm gonna put a actually someone also last week told me to put a box down first and then put my school header and just layer that so I think I'm gonna try that too and that'll probably work out well too So I'm just going to layer this then on top. And that actually works out well, so I don't even have to cut the box. So moving on to Sunday, we already have... Oh, I didn't even put my heart checklist. I'm so out of it. Um, back to my heart checklist. I need for Saturday... Four. I need four heart checklists. Or four hearts on my heart checklist. All right, and then moving on to Sunday, we already have our weekend banner. Avery is going to need a bath again. I'm just going to layer it a little bit. And then I have one TV show, so I'm going to grab my little things. And grab a TV. like that and that's really it so then I'm gonna put my last to-do header for the week and, and my last ombre heart checkbox I do have one left so I don't know what I'm gonna do with it but I have it I think I'm gonna put the uh, full box down now and then put the school header again even though it does kind of fit pretty well uh, just because I do kind of like that. I think it works out really nice. So I'm going to put my last school header. And then my heart checklist for Sunday needs two hearts. Okay. So that is Thursday through Sunday. Okay, so here's the week in full. I still need to do the sidebar, but like I showed you guys at the beginning, I did get my uh, Planner Kate stackable sidebars. I have dinner next week and to do. So I'm gonna start by putting next week. I think I'm just gonna switch out the colors. So next week I will use the orange one. Don't I typically start from the top though? Let me do my top one really fast too. I'm just gonna put the last full box on top of, or I'll hold on to it, I don't know. Anyway, next week, and then I'll do dinner in this blue color. 
like I said, I'm all over the place today. I literally, I feel very crazy because it's already almost eight and I'm, I've lost my mind. And then I'll do the to-do in this lighter orange. And I need to put a little bit of washi to fill that space. So hold on, let me see if I can eyeball it. Yeah, pretty good. And then I'll fill the space with some blue washi. Just like that. So I'm going to go ahead and turn off. Actually, before I turn off the camera, I do think I'm going to try and use these mini event stickers. I've never used them before, but I think I'm going to. So I'm going to use the payday sticker on top of Tuesday since it is payday. I'm going to use the, I have a cleaning sticker. I just saw it. The cleaning sticker on top of Friday. I like how these fit really well. Um, let's see what else we have in here. Martin Luther King Jr. Day is Monday, so I can put that right there. Do I have anything else crazy? Not really. I think that's really it that I can use. So I'm going to put those aside. So anyway, so I'm going to turn off the camera and fill everything out. I just brought out a black Statler pen. I think I used the Le Pen pen last week. I used the Le Pen pen last week, and I didn't really like how it wrote on the matte stickers. And although I'm not really writing on any matte stickers this week, I do personally prefer the Statlers. That's just my own personal preference, though. So I'm going to turn off the camera, fill everything out, and I will be right back to decorate. Okay, so that's everything filled out. We totally didn't plan our dinners at all this week, which is which is bad because when we went grocery shopping today, we literally had no idea what to get. It was terrible. Never do that. We always do that and we didn't do it today and it was the worst. So I'm going to do some minor decorating. I do have the Scribble Prince Co. January monthly colored decorative sheet. Um, nothing too crazy though, nothing too wild. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do that and then that's it. So that's it for my basically just January colored monthly plan with me. I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me and definitely stay tuned for next week for my next plan with me. It's going to be my last one of the month and it's actually going to be a collab. So I'm really, really excited about that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me. Subscribe to my channel if you are not already and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.